Have you wanted to know how to work with real estate agents, but you don't know how to have that conversation? Check out this call I just had, uh, this pocket listing that I got, and how I'm navigating this to go see the house and make an offer to the seller. Hey, sorry about that. I was on the other line when you called back. Do you have time to talk now? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I was just saying thanks for uh, reaching back out to me and uh, wanted to see if how the situ if the situation changed from the last time we talked about. It. I think he said he wanted to do the roof or something like that, right? Yeah, he was gonna do the roof and then um, he's getting bid now mm -hmm. on it. And I'm just at the point where I'm like, let's just see if we can get somebody in and give an offer and okay. see where we're at. So yeah. So okay. Try to do that. Yeah, that's a great idea. I think uh, if he can see realistically, like w what would make sense for a flipper, right? Like, uh, and he can mm -hmm. say, okay, hey, this doesn't make sense for me, or it does, you know, then it might be easy for him to know what <laughs> what option to go with, right? Right. Right. Okay. So that's what. That's what. Yeah. That's what I thought, and I just thought, oh, I'm just gonna call you back because I just really we were trying to get all these bids and all this stuff, and we just gotta get him out of here. His health isn't going well, and his son's coming down this weekend, and he's gonna try and get him out. Right. Here. So that's why I'm like, okay, let's just see what you have to offer. <laughs> of course. You know? Yeah. Does he has he considered put? So there's obviously a cash offer where he's completely like doesn't have to worry about anything, but those usually come in pretty low. I, I think I don't know if you know that, but cash offers they they have to include like the rehab and all that stuff. So people are usually kind of shocked at how low they are, but <laughs> it's just because it includes all the expenses, the hard money costs or the carrying costs. But has he considered of like partnering potentially with a, like a, a flipper that, you know, they can uh, do the deal. Well, I'd have to explain a little bit more in depth, but they pretty much partnered together and do the flip uh, while he's there. Is that uh, an option? He, he hasn't, he hasn't even thought that direction yet. Okay. But I think after his son gets here, I'm going to try and talk him into that. Okay. Because I just, I just don't honestly like, he thinks he's going to get so much money out of it, and he's going to see that he's not going to. And yeah. if I just listed it, I mean, it won't go SHJ with the roof at all. Yeah. You know, and so you'd have to put the money in to do the roof, and he doesn't have the money to do the roof. So, so, so if he worked with I mean, someone that maybe did, and, you know, obviously there was, you know, benefits to someone that was willing to take that risk and do that work. Yeah, and they, yesterday, they're like, we don't want to take that risk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. You, know? you said someone said that? You said someone was, uh, he asked that of someone they didn't want to take that risk, like someone to pay for it? Yeah, they were actually going to go do the roof and, and then just get it out of the equity. Okay. But they were like, I don't know, this might be just too much. It'd be better if we just bought it. So they, they're kind of thinking like you are, just like the flipping thing. But yeah. I, you called me first, so I came back to you first. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. And and I'm that was another flipper, I'm assuming? Well, they don't usually do flips. But he was willing to do a flip on it, yeah. Oh, gotcha. Okay. He's a contractor that was going to do the roof, and then he's like, I'd rather just buy it and fix it up. <laughs> yeah, so, for sure. Yeah, did he? Did he? Did he? Not a normal flipper. Okay. Did he get a chance to make an offer? I'm just curious, like, if he, he threw one out anyway, like, to buy it. No. No, he didn't really. He said he'd have to look and, and you know, kind of figure it out. And that's what right. he said as of last night. Gotcha. So I hadn't got, he hasn't got back to me yet. And I just thought, well, if we're going that direction, we're going to just do that. Then I might as well call you back. Yeah, of course. Okay. So I, uh, I'm i in Arizona right now, and I'll be back Saturday, like, afternoon and morning. So I could – if is it okay if I come, like, Monday or Tuesday? Well, actually, Tuesday is actually would be better for me if that's the soonest I'd probably be able to go if that's not too late. Tuesday would be fine. See what I have on Tuesday. What time are you thinking? Let me pull up my – It have to be – no. It have to be what? I, I have appointments in the afternoon, so I don't know how it would be like – how would 11 be? Um, 11 o'clock. <laughs> I can do 11 o'clock. I just have to be back by 1. Uh, 11 o'clock would work good. Okay. Right, and, and it probably shouldn't take that, you know, because I have an appointment in, at 12, so it probably, probably won't take that long to just go there and check it out, so. Okay. Okay, let's go do that. What's I'm your... I'll set it up with, but let, and I'll confirm, but yeah, let's just go ahead and find that. Okay, perfect. And can you give me the address just one more time so I can put it on my calendar? Yes, it's... 774 East okay. Jepson Avenue. Did you say Jepson? Uh huh. J E P S O N. Okay. And it's uh, Milk, is it Mill Creek? Yeah, it's under um, Salt Lake City. Okay. okay, Salt Lake City. 
Cool. Well, I'll plan on being there and you can text me if there's anything, you know, different um, that happens. But, you know, I can go. I also like to kind of present the options. Like I, I bring my laptop and just say, hey, like these are the options that I can buy the house and, you know, tell me what you're thinking. Just so he knows, you know, if he wants to work with an investor, it's not just always a cash offer. There's multiple things we can do and, and see if, you know, what okay. he's open to. Okay. That sounds great. And that will be good because the sun will be down here and I know he just wants to get it over and done with. So he might look at that option a lot faster than how he was originally looking at it. Yeah, and, and I'm curious, like, uh, what are you thinking about the market as right now? I like to ask every agent I talk to just because it's, you know, I, everybody's kind of seeing different things. Are you seeing, um, like, yeah, I guess what are you seeing right now? Well, not, not a whole lot of movement. Yeah. And, you know, it just seems like everything's just kind of really slow right now, and, and prices are kind of stable. They're not really... They're definitely not going up. Yeah. <laughs> but there's not a lot of inventory, so it's like we're not really seeing them really go down either. I'm not thinking on the market for a long time. Exactly. Yeah, it's interesting. It's yeah. kind of it's on kind of interesting as a flipper to speculate like, is it going to go up? Is it going to go down? Like, you know, because oh, no. you you want to make sure you buy. From South Carolina, and he's like, he has a great house, and I go, oh, your house is so fast. He's like, I hope it's a good building. And he's not getting anything. And I'm like, I'm surprised. I was really surprised. So. Wow. And that's in South Carolina, it's you said? Also, yeah. It's also location, too, you know. Of course. Yeah. Okay. Well, I really appreciate your time. Is there anything else you want to run by me or chat about? Not that I can think of right off. I'll probably have more questions when we're together there. So. Okay. I'll try to think of what I need to ask you then. Okay. Well, uh, I look, I look forward to meeting you. And uh, so, I, again, just we have 11 o'clock next Tuesday. All right. Have a great night. Thank you. Okay, you too. Thanks. Yep. Ethan. Bye. Okay. Bye-bye. And by the way, if you like this video, smash that like button so more people can see it. And we'll get you more content like this where we show you exactly how to do it step by step.